नेवर किल योर स्टूपिड आइडिया बी स्टूपिड 25th April 2016 a stupid idea changed my life my mom and dad are amazing cooks and i guess that's what sparked the cook in baby sanjot as a 12 year old i cooked my first pav bhaji i hated studies but scored 95 in home science in my 10th board exams hated studies but topped my hotel management university got to be a food producer on MasterChef season 4 and worked with my cooking heroes until now everything seems to be so perfect right learning further from Le Cordon Bleu London was my next goal but i could not turn down a lot of show offers because i did not want to create for someone else my only plan to study in london did not happen and it made me clueless to what to do next i chose the only immediate option to work with my dad and staying away from cooking was still a nightmare just to be in touch with food i registered a domain yourfoodlab.com and a facebook page in the first week itself every night i thought about what your food lab will be with a million different thoughts I did not come to know when a year passed by and I had no idea then too. One day with a lot of fear and courage I told my dad that I wasn't happy and if I don't cook now I won't be cooking ever again. I just requested Saturdays and Sundays off to which he generously said yes. And the next question was but what would you do? I seriously had no idea then too. I realized the lack of fast-paced food content in India and my weekend holiday was here. I grabbed my phone and a camera with my friend and shot my first video. And finally, I got my stupid idea. Upload a recipe video every day on Facebook. With rented cameras, DIY ceiling lights, my dinner table in my living room without any professional video background. I shot more than 100 videos and started shooting more and more videos on weekends. But never had the guts to upload them. I showed my first few videos to one of my mentors and he said, "Who would watch these videos?" People around me said, "Do something more substantial. You would get bored and stop doing it very soon." Do it just as a hobby. This can't be your full-time career. How would you earn? How would you sustain? Facebook is not for being a creator. It's just for socializing. I was just being told to kill my stupid idea. My idea was much bigger. I had shot content for more than three months before uploading a single video. I finally uploaded the first video on Facebook. 25th April 2016 pizza dosa at 6 pm that's when my stupid idea came to life the first video hit 10k in just a day with amazing comments from people i never knew the second video in a day crossed 1 lakh views but hold on my third video no bake mango cheesecake hit a million views and that's when my stupid idea wasn't stupid anymore comments messages from all over the world started pouring in people shared how my recipes were becoming an important thing in their lives that feeling is one i'll treasure for life wifel crossed a lakh followers in just a month and my idea of uploading one video every day grew stronger people around me now said wow you're internet famous you have a lakh followers your videos look beautiful but how does this help you you still do not earn any money how will you earn followers are not going to feed you that's just a number what is the future i was told again and again my idea was just still stupid just within 5 months i got my first brand endorsement with a leading fmcg brand soon i started endorsing big brands brands wanted to work with me and yes i did start making some money The views kept increasing, my YFL fam was growing, and yes, YFL became a global community. 
I hit a million followers in a year and that was the biggest goal I had ever achieved. With the money, the rented equipment turned into professional video equipment. The next goal was to be best digital food content creator in India. Everything was going great and once again I got another stupid idea. A four-year-old boy teaching cooking on YFL and this is how YFL Junior with my nephew Super Chef Ian was born. It was an instant success and people today love Ian more than all the other content pieces on YFL. I started working with Facebook closely, spoke on forums, did more and more brand endorsements, was aired on Forbes Tycoons of Tomorrow. I'm Chef Sanjod Key, founder of Your Food Lab. Media houses started writing about me. Millions of people around the world prove every day how crazy ideas work. Mark Zuckerberg started Facebook in his dorm room with just an idea which changed how we interact today. His idea worked and became my career foundation. In the last three years, I created 1000 videos and now YFL has crossed more than 3 million followers on Facebook and is loved on other platforms as well. It does not matter what people around you think. What matters is what you think and how much you can give in to achieve what you crazily want. From choosing home science, having cooking as a career, being a creator on Facebook and not allowing people around me to kill my stupid ideas, made this journey one which I do not want to change. And you guys, my followers, my YFL fam, my mom and dad, my to be wife, my sister, my family, a few friends, and most importantly, my YFL team made it possible to prove each one who said that I was stupid, that yes, stupid ideas do work. Do what it takes and do not kill your stupid idea. Hi, so we are live. Hi Chennai, this is Chef Sanjot Keer. Going live to wish you guys a very happy Diwali. This is one of my first live video Q&A session. I am live again. We are here at Facebook's Mumbai office. Right now I'm here in Maharashtra in the village where I'm shooting content for my viewers. I always love doing these live sessions with you guys. Hi mom! As a kid I always watched my mom cook amazing food. She was the best ever cook for me always since birth and she still is. Hi. 